Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Kim from DIY Dream Weddings and um, I hope you're all well. So um, I'm going to do the next part of this project very quickly because um, we've got a little bit of a storm going on here and I wanted to keep the light. So yeah, so what I'm going to do, this is a hanging wedding bouquet or it can be a decoration, okay? It's made of craft foam. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put these um, petals on. I did do another part of this uh, project in a different video okay so if you want to have a look back you can so what I'm going to do is put these on so basically I'm going to put these I want to know where these have got to go so I'm going to put them like this just so that, so that I know where I'm going to put these when I put them on okay I'm going to glue these on these petals but you can look back like I said and see how I've made these up I haven't made all of them because I wanted to get on here like I said and uh, while we've got the light because uh, we had some terrible um, weather just now and it just it just poured down and there was just no sort of no light really so I'm, I'm going to do it this way and as I'm doing this I want to say to you because if you watch the first video you know what I'm saying when you uh, measure these petals the best way of doing this I realise now is to measure from the middle to the edge of the um, of your um, frame and then whatever it measures add an extra centimeter on and then you'll get the right sort of size petal there to um, put on your um, to put onto your um, onto your bouquet or your frame okay so I'm just gonna basically just put these petals on and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how I um, I'm going to make the you've probably you've actually mo most of this you've seen in the last video but what I'm going to do is show you how I connect connect this how I make this again and then how I connect it up to this the next one up to this one because I haven't actually done that yet so that will be something I've done on here first Okay, and I think we could do that, or we could do, what did we do? That, that's probably better. I think they're about the same. We'll do that. So yeah, I just basically, that's what I did. I just kind of measured. So we're just putting the petals in between and I just measured the from the middle to the outside of the frame and then added a centimetre on and that works for the, the length of these petals because when you fold them they dip inwards and you lose the length you lose the original length okay so yeah so I'm going to do that I think okay so I'm just doing these where they fit at the moment we could do it like that let's have another go Sorry, I can't remember which bit I originally measured that for. I think it was this. That looks a bit short now. But hey, it works, it works. It still works. I need to have something to stick that to if I do. If we do that, that will work as well. Let's do that. Let's do what we did before. Stick that like that. Because we won't really want them the same sort of length. You can go longer with these two, it's up to you. I'm just, this is how I'm going to do it for now for this one. Okay. And I'm going to do. You don't want to lose, basically, because you're sticking it to these ones underneath. You don't want to lose something to stick it to. So you've got to watch and see, see where you're going to stick these when you stick them on. Okay. I normally do this as I'm going along, but because it's for the video, I sort of had to, you know, had to think ahead a little bit. So let's do it that way. Slightly longer than the other one, but I have moved the position of these a little bit because, like I said, you need to have something to glue it to underneath. So I'm hoping that will be okay when I glue the other two. I haven't done the other two yet. But that's what I'll do. I'll glue them on. See that? They could be longer. But I did work out that if you do measure it like that and add a centimetre on, it does work. But these I've used for a different... Unless I can... Can I move those? 
I can't move those now, they're stuck. It works, it works, okay. Um, right, so now what we're going to do is I've decided to do the other part of the bouquet um, with, um, with this mauve colour, okay. So I'm going to show you how I stick this together again. So we're going to, this end we're going to do like this. So we're just going to stick our two pieces together and these are, let's put a bit more glue under that bit there. These are 29 centimetres in length and I've cut them at one and a half in width, okay. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to join this to, um, to this one. And how I'm going to do that is I'm just going to bring that up through here. Right, okay, I want my curve to curve upwards. Okay, so I'm going to do it this way, like this. So you've got to watch which way you want your curve to curve upwards. I'm just going to bring that over a bit so you can see what I mean. I want that to curve upwards and that's how I've stuck that on. So I've stuck, stuck it on so that my um, teardrop curves upwards. Okay, so that's how I'm going to do that. Curves upwards at the bottom, okay. And you don't want to get it twisted, so you want it to look the same as this one. Um, make sure that's straight when you stick that on like that. Okay, so that is how you connect those up, those two up like that. Okay, and then um, I'm going to do I also do a handle, and I think the way I'm going to do that is going to be a bit different because. I'm going to have to think about that because with the heart one, see this is what we're making, but we're making a teardrop one, okay? But with this heart one, you've got this bit that goes down to put the handle on. So I'm going to have to a little think about that with this because it's a different shape. So I hope that kind of explains where we are with this project. And like I said, once I've done these bits here, these other petals here, I'm just going to stick this round piece on top for the middle. Okay, so um, that's what I'm going to do with that. I think we're still going. Yeah, we are. But I'm going to do it in blue. I'm not going to do it in uh, pink. Okay, so um, how long have we been on for? Not very long, about seven minutes. That's not too bad. I could carry on and show you what I mean with these. With these... What I normally, what well, I've done those two there. So we need two more to go on, one in between each one. So basically I would measure that and that would be, that's eight and a half. So then I would say you would put another nine and a half on that. Okay, from there to there's eight and a half. And then I would put, um, sorry, another centimetre on that, which would be nine and a half. Okay, I think that's right. It's just whether I've worked it out right, but I think that's right. So then what I would do is I would go ahead. Where did I, that was that one, wasn't it? Because this, let me just have a look, because this is eight, you see. Because this is eight and it's a bit shorter. Actually, that kind of works. Which bit, no, I measured this, didn't I? That's shorter. Yeah. Yeah, so we do nine and so we do what's that? I can't see it. Yeah. So we do um yeah, nine and a half, I said, didn't I? We do nine and a half for that. Um so we do if I can get nine and a half out of this. We'll see if, I know that works normally, so we'll, uh, oh, I haven't got enough, got enough foam. Um, let's have a go, this, this way we have. So if we do nine and a half from this end, uh, so if we go, nine and a half there okay to that edge there 
sorry I'm just running out of foam here and I'm just hoping I can do that I think I'll just about get I'll just about get all the petals off of this little bit of foam I'm hoping I will anyway okay and then we'll do nine and a half to there okay and then what we'll do is we'll and it doesn't matter if it's a bit longer we'll just join these up like this so if you want to have a little bit more detail as to how to do this just go back on the other video and you'll see that there I just thought I'd show you that's what I'm going to do with this I'm just going to add another little bit on from what I've measured and I would say add a centimeter on and then if it's too long you can always cut, cut a little bit off but if it's too short um, you can't add a bit on so that's that's the way I see it so do it a bit longer if you're not sure okay so I'm going to just then turn that around like that and then I've made some marks along here which are one centimeter out from the edge just so that it measures one centimeter in width and then you've got your nine and a half there um, across okay so we're going to do that and I'm going to double check this because like I said sometimes I can't quite see what's on the ruler and I get it wrong so let's have a go yeah see that's eight and a half I've done it again that's not oh, I'm getting my eyes tested folks I am that is nine and a half there that's eight and a half so we want to go nine and a half sorry about that guys see that's that's a centimeter out there I need to get some bifocals and then I'll know what I'm doing <laughs> um, I also need that I think I need those for my job as well so yeah that's one thing I've got to look into getting some bifocals so let's do that again so from there to there is nine and a half and from there to there is nine and a half also the other thing is I've um quite a long way from because I'm standing up I'm quite a long way from the desk and that's the only way that I can um, so we've got nail shape here to make our petal okay so that's the only way I can really film it um, and also it's easier for my back as well so um, there we go so that is what you want really so you want a nail shape measured nine and a half that way and nine and a half that way okay and we're probably going to find out it's too long now but hey um, it depends on my maths how good my maths is as to whether it fits where we want we want that to fit in there and that is right that's right so there we go so that's what we want so we're going to I'm going to take my hot glue and I'm going to stick that together like that okay I'm not going to worry about the little marks around it too much there we are because this isn't really going to be given to anybody and if you've got nothing to stick it to underneath you can stick it to the to this part as well so I think what we'll do is we'll move that over a little touch and we'll put a little bit of glue on there and we'll put glue on the end as well okay just so that we can have enough to stick the other one to Okay, and we'll stick that in there and like I said when we've done this we will cover up this messiness with um, a little centerpiece there like that okay and this one I would say what's that that's seven and a half there when I measure all eight seven and a half seven and a half I do that at eight and a half they're about eight and a half centimetres okay so there we are because that's seven and a half there okay I'm going to do that last one off camera okay so just to keep this video a bit shorter for you uh, and then I'm going to be doing this one and I'm going to do this one exactly the same and I'm going to do it in this lovely in this lovely mauve colour and then we'll be finished and the only little video I might do will be to uh add the handle on the top because I haven't quite worked out how I'm going to do that I might actually do it um, I'm going to do it the same shape I might do it like this so if I join it together and then just add another piece on the top there or we could just turn that round and glue that on like that 
So that's what I might do for the handle for this. Okay, but I'll come back and show you that. Okay then, and the, how to put these bits on as well. Okay then, so um, I hope you enjoyed this video. It's going to be quite a short project, I think. Um, so I'll see you again next time. Um, and don't forget to like and subscribe if you like what you see, because if you press that subscribe button, you'll get more videos just like this one. And it will also help the channel if you, you like as well and subscribe. Okay then, um, I hope you're all well and uh, have enjoy the rest of your week. Bye-bye now.